So here we are, another brew day. Um, this time I'm using my HD 1080p cam, so let me know if it's any different for you guys. And today I'm doing the test IPA that I did on uh, YouTube a few a couple of weeks ago. Um, it's a pretty basic recipe, but I uh, thought I might brew it up it looks nice And I tend not to get piss all dough balls when I do it like that. As you can see, there's not really any dough balls in there. Maybe one. Two. Done. Okay. Okay. We uh, we just hit the, the. We're just starting the um, mash, and uh, I'll just show you guys. Um, Sixty-four point six degrees. And that's actually a degree out, well about a degree and a half, so it's actually 66. Okay. Done our, our mash. Now we're going to wall off. It generally takes about 2 litres to do this. I always started off fairly slow and then after the grain bed set, uh, turn it up. Can turn that up a little bit more. Let's have a look at it. Yeah, it's full of particles. But that's all good, that's what you expect at the start. And this liter, I will just let it ride after this. I can turn it up a little bit more now because the grain bed's fairly well set.
Okay, so we'll stir that up again. And we'll just see what we've got. Temperature wise. We should hit 70. Looks like we might be a wee way off. Oh no, not too bad. 68. Close enough. Anyway, I'll get back to it. And we've got the same process again. We've soaked for 10 minutes. And we'll put that in there. Put that up there. We're just running the, uh, wait until the runnings become clear. For anyone who doesn't know what I'm doing. It's always two litres I seem to take out and then it becomes pretty particle free. And at this stage I'm going to plug my elements in. just in case you haven't seen them yet. That's my element, or one of them. They are immersion elements, 2,000 watts a piece, so that's 4,000 watts. And uh, it's all good. Good stuff. Yeah. Where are we at? About six litres off. Okay, we just had a boil. We'll see if we can't get it to a rolling boil. I tend to just bloody leave it. Only takes 30 seconds a minute because this is quite a big pot. This is a 50 litre pot. And 
and that would be the hot break. She's coming along pretty good. And we've got uh, 10 grams of Columbus in there for the 60 minute boil. And that's pretty good. We're going to dump them in. There we go. And we'll start our timer and we'll be back at the next hop edition. And we're putting our uh, 50 grams of Galaxy and 50 grams of New Zealand Cascade. That's how much we got. That's what we got going on. Let's see if I can do this without burning myself. For eight minutes. And that's all our hop additions. The Irish moss is in. I forgot to film it, but the, you got that. It's only put an Irish moss in, it's no big drama. And uh, we'll add the wart chiller. And this is how I add my wart chiller. I pull that up to there. And then I grab onto these and pull them up the side and Bob's your uncle. Now, okay, so we've got this at 29, we'll say 29 ish degrees. So we're gonna rehydrate our yeast. smell that yeast. Okay. Now we get a glad rat. Glad wrap over the top. And that will be good to go. Turn that tap on. The most wonderful time for a beer. With the kids jingle belling and everyone telling you to brew your beer. It's the most wonderful time. Into the fermenter we go. 
Let's sanitize them into letters. Just got the clean up to go and we're all set. Cheers, thanks for watching.